Today's video topic is Glanzmann's disease. Glanzmann's disease, or Glanzmann's thrombosthenia, is a rare blood disorder that affects the function of platelets, which are essential components of the blood clotting process. This disorder is characterized by increased bleeding and the difficulty of blood to form clots. It is considered as a rare disorder as it affects one in every one million persons. Causes The Glanzmann's disease affects the body's ability to form blood clots. This is caused by a deficiency in a specific protein called the platelet glycoprotein 2B3A complex, which is necessary for the formation of normal platelets. This deficiency is genetic. It is inherited in an autosomal recessive pattern, which means that both parents must carry the gene in order for the child to be affected. So if you have a family history of the disease, then you have an increased risk of having the deficiency. People with Glanzmann's thrombosthenia are more likely to develop excessive bleeding, especially after surgery or physical trauma. Symptoms The most common symptom of Glanzmann's thrombosthenia is excessive bleeding, which can occur after even minor injuries or during and after surgery. Other symptoms include easy bruising, nosebleeds, excessive bleeding of the gums, and bleeding from the gastrointestinal tract and urinary tract. Diagnosis Glanzmann's thrombosthenia is most often diagnosed in infancy, but it can also be diagnosed in adulthood if symptoms are present. Glanzmann's thrombosthenia is typically diagnosed through a combination of physical examination and laboratory tests. These tests may include complete blood count, CBC, platelet count, platelet aggregation tests, and genetic tests. Treatment Unfortunately, there is no cure for Glanzmann's thrombosthenia. But there are treatments available to manage symptoms. The treatment of Glanzmann's thrombosthenia depends on the severity of the condition. The main goal is to reduce the frequency and severity of bleeding episodes. So, the primary treatment for Glanzmann's thrombosthenia is to replace or supplement the missing or defective platelets. Treat This can be done through blood transfusions, injections of clotting factors, or through the use of medications such as aspirin or desmopressin. In some cases, the patient may need to take medication for the rest of their life to help maintain an acceptable level of platelets. Complications There are some potential complications associated with Glanzmann's thrombosthenia. People with Glanzmann's thrombosthenia may experience delayed wound healing and may be at an increased risk of developing infections due to their inability to form clots. People with Glanzmann's thrombosthenia may also suffer from anemia due to chronic bleeding or iron deficiency. Additionally, people with Glanzmann's thrombosthenia may be at an increased risk of developing other autoimmune diseases. So, it is important for people with Glanzmann's disease to be aware of the potential risks and complications associated with the disorder. Patients should talk to their doctor about the best ways to manage their condition and reduce their risk of complications. Additionally, people with Glanzmann's disease should report any new or unusual bleeding to their doctor immediately. By staying aware of the risks and complications associated with Glanzmann's disease and following their doctor's instructions, patients with Glanzmann's disease can significantly reduce their risk of developing long-term complications of the disorder. Thank you for watching our video. Please do not forget to like and share the video. Also, please subscribe to the channel to stay updated on our latest videos.